Welcome back to my channel. When we design a network, we need to uh, extract the output of the design. So we simply go to the flex table and copy all the data and paste in our report. But uh, there is another inbuilt option of extracting report in water gems. Many of us doesn't know the option exists. So I will tell you how to extract the report from water gems into different format. So let's start the video. You will get the uh, extraction option in report. Uh, there are three options here. You can see scenario summary. If you have more than one scenario, you can go to the option and it will generate the report on multiple scenarios. Here you can see we have only sin uh, one scenario. So it uh, giving us the uh, summary of uh, this scenario. Okay. Then we have hydraulic model inventory. You will get the all the highlights in uh, this report of currently uh, working uh, design. First scenario summary, you will get the all the changes you have made in the scenario. So we didn't make anyone. So further you will get the pipe summary. There are 165 pipes used in this network, 166 junction and one tank. Uh, here you can see the isolation walls and most importantly we have pressure pipe inventory here you will see the all the diameters and the length given in the summary mm, if you want to extract pipe table and junction table you have to go to the flex table and pipe table you will get the option here you can see the report and click on report current time step it will generate report something like this you can change the page size from here you will get the multiple options a4 portrait you can also extract the report in portrait here 100% you can see this is the preview of the report you are going to extract then if you have multiple columns, you can go to the A3 and landscape option where all the columns will add on. If you adjust and uh, minimize the width of the column, you can go to the flex table and directly reduce the columns from here. Okay, it will shorten the page size you can see all the columns are in the one page then we have option of multiple page in one uh, screen here you can see if I click on that four pages will be display on the screen we have multiple options nine pages then we have the background option you can also change the color of the background from here you will see we have multiple color option this tool really doesn't necessary tool but everything we need to know is here okay there is light gray transparent i will give the white color to the background then we can also use wo watermark to the report if you have any watermark click on that and type what you want to add i just type water gems and change the color in light gray increase its size to 120 give it bold italic and minimize its transparency you can change its direction from here 
will give forward in forward diagonal click on ok it will be applied to the all the pages if you want to specific page we also have that option click on that and one two three okay all the other pages will not be marked you can also use the uh, water gem watermark in picture format here you will see text watermark and picture watermark load the image if I choose any image okay minimize its transparency and click on ok it will apply to the only three pages because we choose the page range click on all and all the report is marked by picture watermark I will clear all the settings clear all click on ok last option we have the save this file in different format first is PDF so click on PDF click on ok choose the location and save do you want to open this file yes here you will see the preview of the extracted PDF this is the PDF format you can also extract in HTML file page border color it is black single file click on if you want to change the title this is the title pipe click on ok choose the location save as you will see all the file in HTML format it is very helpful in sharing uh, this format it is very uh, it is very less and uh, uses less data so you can prefer uh, this type of file then we have MHD which is same as HTML we can also extract in Excel format if you want to change the sheet name I will change the sheet name as pipe inventory click on ok choose the location save and open you will see all the result in excel format it is very convenient, convenient because we can change or edit or modify this file uh, by our demand and requirement okay so it is very useful tool so that's it for now guys if you have any queries or any question you can comment below or follow me on LinkedIn I will try to give you all the answers you need to know okay Thank you guys.